First Person Singular. The views expressed in this piece are those of the writer. The late Ida Balsam speaks to the young activists of the world. I lived in a war zone during World War II. I feel very lucky that my family did not perish when we were bombed. I can't imagine being left on my own like so many thousands of war refugee children whose daily existence is a constant battle for survival. When I think of this colossal tragedy, I wonder which of these youngsters could have grown up to be teachers, poets, or the best farmers in their respective villages. These horrific living conditions have aroused the attention of our more fortunate younger adults. They are volunteering to help all over the globe. They are teaching farmers a better way to cultivate food with the help of modern techniques. Other younger adults, like my nephew Ben, who has an advanced degree in mathematics, are giving up lucrative salaries to teach in troubled public schools. Similarly, two of my grandchildren are working to better the environment. Yafa has done volunteer work addressing severe water shortages in India, and her brother Nathan is a marine biologist studying biodiversity and the protection of endangered marine resources. I'm an older woman who's deeply grateful to all these young idealists. My name is Ida Balsam. Ida Balsam died in June of 2022. She wrote a book called Escape from Antwerp. This piece was produced by Mead Fisher and Lori Korn.